Chrome, Firefox, Safari? With so many web browsers out there, how do you know which one is actually the best in 2025? Some focus on speed, others on privacy, and a few, well, let's just say they're still catching up. Today, we're ranking the top web browsers, breaking down their strengths and weaknesses, and helping you find the perfect one for your needs. Let's jump in. First on our list is Google Chrome, the most widely used browser in the world. But is it actually the best? Let's start with what makes Chrome great. One of its biggest strengths is speed. Thanks to Chrome's V8 JavaScript engine, it loads web pages incredibly fast, making it a top choice for users who value performance. Next, the extension library. Chrome has the largest selection of extensions, allowing you to customize everything from productivity tools to ad blockers and themes. And then there's security. Chrome gets frequent updates to patch vulnerabilities, keeping your data safer from cyber threats. But, as good as Chrome is, it does have some major downsides. It's a RAM-hungry beast. If you have multiple tabs open, Chrome can slow down your entire system. Privacy concerns are a big issue. Google collects a lot of user data, which can be a deal-breaker for those who value anonymity online. And despite its incognito mode, your activity can still be tracked by websites and your internet provider. Solution? If you love Chrome but want better privacy, consider using a VPN or switching to a more private browser, which we'll cover next. If privacy is your priority, then Mozilla Firefox might be the best web browser for you. One of Firefox's biggest strengths is transparency. Unlike Chrome, it's open source, meaning anyone can inspect the code for security flaws, making it one of the most trusted browsers out there. Next, Firefox is built for privacy. It automatically blocks third-party cookies, social media trackers, and fingerprinting attempts, giving you better control over your data. Customization is another area where Firefox shines. You can tweak almost every part of its interface, from themes to button placement, making it one of the most flexible browsers available. But just like Chrome, Firefox has its downsides too. Here are some things to consider before switching. It can be a memory hog. Firefox isn't as lightweight as some other browsers. It occasionally freezes when handling too many open tabs. The mobile version isn't as polished as the desktop experience. Solution? If you're experiencing performance issues, consider adjusting Firefox's settings or limiting the number of extensions you install. Now, if you want a browser that blocks ads, trackers, and protects your privacy by default, Brave is the way to go. First, let's talk about built-in security. Unlike other browsers that require add-ons for privacy, Brave blocks ads, trackers, and cross-site tracking automatically, which also makes pages load faster. And for extra anonymity, Brave includes private browsing with Tor, which helps hide your IP address and encrypts your activity. But no browser is perfect, and Brave has a few downsides too. Here's what to watch out for. Tor browsing is slower than regular private browsing. Brave's cryptocurrency reward system isn't for everyone. Solution? You can disable the Brave Rewards feature if you're not interested in its crypto system. Next up, we have Microsoft Edge, a browser that's come a long way since the days of Internet Explorer. It's built on the same engine as Chrome, so you get fast performance, but with less memory usage. Unique features like reading mode and built-in page markup tools make Edge great for students and professionals. And if you're a gamer, Edge is optimized for Xbox Cloud Gaming and even has a dedicated gaming mode. But before you make the switch, here's what you need to know. It has a smaller extension library than Chrome. Bing is the default search engine, though you can change it. Solution? If you like Edge but want Google Search, just switch the default search engine in settings. Last but not least, we have Safari, the default browser for Apple devices. It's incredibly fast and energy efficient, making it the best choice for Mac users. It's privacy focused, blocking cross-site tracking, and reducing fingerprinting. It syncs seamlessly with iCloud, so if you're in the Apple ecosystem, browsing across devices is effortless. So, after breaking down the top web browsers, which one should you use? If you want the fastest performance, Google Chrome and Microsoft Edge are your best bets. For privacy-focused browsing, Brave and Firefox offer the best protection against trackers and ads. And if you're an Apple user, Safari is the most optimized choice for Mac and iOS. Ultimately, the best web browser depends on your needs, whether it's speed, security, or seamless integration. Now you know which one is right for you. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more deep dives into the top web browsers, tech reviews, and internet security tips. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Thank you.